this tree is about to snap, so if it snaps midway through the video and I die, uh, I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> On a real note, I don't want this tree to break. <laughs> this is my new recording station. It's super comfy and it's such a nice view here. I think a lot of the negativity that we see, especially online, I think a lot of it actually stays online. And after detaching myself from the internet for a long time, well, not like detaching myself, but after like going on a dopamine detox, spending more time in nature than on my phone, I started to realize that life is a lot more positive than I think. How are you? I hope you've been good. I hope things have been all right. My name is Wada and I help other young men like me take back control of their lives. I do sometimes forget that life is so much more positive than I think. Anytime I'm talking to like people that are my co-workers or like friends, sometimes they do come up with really negative shit. <laughs> and I'm sat there thinking, damn, you are not in a good mood today. And they just explain and they're like, oh, well, I had a lion, didn't feel so good. You know, I looked at the news, the news wasn't too great. The weather's been shit. They just come up with so many negative things and I'm, I'm sat here thinking of the positive that they're telling me. Like they're telling me that the weather isn't good, it's really, really windy, it's really, really, like, rainy. I'm like, nah, that's that's fun. <laughs> go on a trip, go on a, go on a massive, like, journey. There have been so many times where I've been on the journey and it's been raining. It's actually been a lot of fun. At first it sucks, yeah, but then I, as I kind of realize that I have no choice, usually when driving, I'm driving and it's like pouring down with rain. I'm on a motorcycle, so I'm getting drenched and I can't do anything about it. At first, I'm like, fuck, shit, this is so annoying. And then I start getting into it. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna drive in every single puddle I see. I'm gonna get my, I don't care. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get so drenched and wet. I do not give a shit. I am driving in every puddle I see and it's gonna be so much fun. I got slightly distracted, so I'll get back on track again. You know, I went on a trip about a year ago. Yeah, coming up to a year ago now, I went to Thailand. Uh, it's where I was born, and I went back to my hometown, back to where I grew up, and it was so nice, and I, going there when I'm older, it was great. But what, something that was so interesting is the moment I got there, literally, I just landed, the first thing I wanted to do was just go to bed, because I, I was, had jet lag, it was like a 12-hour flight, but my dad said, no, come down to the restaurant, have some, have food, and meet some people, and then go. And I said, okay, all right, okay, I'll do that. And literally within five minutes of sitting down and eating food, I met a new friend that I haven't, I haven't like ever seen before, a new guy, made friends with him, super, super chilled. And then four other guys sat down at our table. And I thought that the new friend I just made knew them, but he didn't. They were complete random strangers. And they just sat down and started talking. And me who had grown up in England pretty much my whole life, where most people don't talk to each other <laughs> and I was there and they were talking to me like as if I'd know as if they'd known me for years and I was so baffled and then as I started like, I was in Thailand for about a couple months and I basically I basically realized that this is normal that was normal and it was not just Thailand it's most most e Asian countries basically anywhere that's not east the eastern world and it was weird being in a culture where people would not be on their phones like there was a random group of guys that i just met in thailand and they said you know what do you want to go on a road trip to like the, the beach no phones no technology we're just gonna drive and i was like hell yeah all right let's go and it was so nice and refreshing and that's what i want to talk about in this video i want you to try something and the thing is the moment i tell you this like 80 percent of you are going to click off but maybe you're part of the 20 percent the 20% who watch this and is actually on self-improvement. Granted, that's not a lot of people. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I'm not a very big channel. I'm, a, I'm quite a small channel. But maybe you are part of that 20%. And you will actually try what I tell you. And that is detach yourself from technology for a week. Just detach yourself from the internet. You can still listen to music, you can still do whatever it is, maybe you're listening to that podcast or whatever, but just detach yourself from the internet. So you're not seeing all this negativity that's on the internet because so much of the negativity stays online. It stays on the internet. Those people who are being super negative, like just on like, what was it Reddit and Twitter, just making sure that they're making an impact that no one cares about. They're commenting something that's like stupid that they're, they're trying to like do something right to make someone's day 
or like slightly less fun or they're trying to instigate some sort of argument all those people yeah they don't go outside they stay inside all day <laughs> they're, they're gremlins mate <laughs> this is why so much of the negativity stays online and doesn't actually come out to real life i sometimes forget that life is so much more positive than i think i just wanted to remind you that as well i've also been trying to do oh look horsies oh shit yeah no they can't see me they're quite far away i've been trying to do longer videos i want to do slightly more longer videos where i'm just making more of an impact so if this has helped you i would be so so appreciative if you clicked on the video in the corner because this video could definitely change your life as well and if you're not subscribed there's a chance that you will never ever find this channel again so if you want to subscribe and see more content like this then go for it stay consistent and do the best you can you know what time it is oh yeah oh yeah we know what time it is self-improvement guess. Mwah.